Okay, we've just hit November 2012. Um, part of the maintenance on aquaponic systems, this one being a bath conic system. Bath above with my potatoes growing in the corner there and again there and some garlic that I had chucked in there as well as an old lettuce. Now part of the maintenance that you should do on your aquaponic systems regardless of the type of media that you're using, this is scoria, you can see in there, Not too many reflections. Once a week always check for pests in your system. I've uh, just pulled out a old lettuce and shaken the head all the way around and used the base of it to plug up the auto siphon so that it floods the whole system soaking the seed look at that, I've even got a beneficial black spider and in the process of doing this you will then find what pests you've got in your bed here's another one coming up now bugger dropped him in the water it's also an opportunity to find out whether your return system, your overflow return system is working or not. And this one is, beautifully. But, after 15 minutes of flooding, look what I found. There's probably upwards of 40, 50 slugs. All dying to get out. All because I flooded the system, crowded them out, of airspace between the rocks and they don't appreciate it but it's a good opportunity to check just what sort of infestations you've got there's another one let's get him and chuck him off there's another one there he is get off Get back in there. Um, chooks love slugs and snails. So what do you do? Feed it to them. Um, I also have some slaters as you can see. I saw another one here. This little slater. Oh, look out. Another one trying to do a runner. Here's another slater there. I don't mind slaters, they just clean up a bit of detritus. Um, which I don't have to clean up, so... Alright, I think we've pretty much... Oh no, there's another one. There he is. I think we've pretty much got them all now. But yeah, if you do that once a week, um, keeps you on top of any pests and bugs and things that you may have. Next one I'll do is that one, then that one, then that one, then that one. That one's already been done, cleaned out and just resting, although I've noticed a couple of comfrey plants have come up. Um, that one's resting and that one's about to be demolished, dismantled and taken out to the farm. Any questions or queries, by all means leave a comment. Positive ones please. Alright.